Hey folks, welcome to another VR video. Today we're checking out something pretty cool. This is the Steam Next Fest demo of Mark's Magnificent Marble Maze. Uh, you can see the VR Trend Magazine lo-fi issue number one in the corner there. And I'm running this using NVIDIA Cloud XR on the Unreal Lite. And I'm using my Samsung Galaxy S22 Ultra to tilt the little labyrinth maze and roll the marble. It's really cool. Now, this is one of the few games that I could get to work without using a gamepad uh, because, again, it's just tilting the marble as we go to play. But it plays really well. It's pretty shaky in the capture, and I apologize for that. But it does play exceptionally well. I just wanted to take a couple of minutes to show this off because it's fairly impressive. Now this is an experiment right now, and I'll leave the directions to the GitLab Whoops. Oh, right off the uh, somewhat slippery, more metallic surface here. Yeah, probably not going to make it through this level. We'll try for a moment here how far we can get. Oh, almost. But Unreal is hoping to make this an integrated feature with the Unreal Light and Unreal Air in the near future. It's very cool to be able to play this game in this environment. which is already kind of an experimental VR view. Uh, there is gonna be a native VR version coming, but for now, it's still kind of an experiment. And there we are finishing another level here. This is, this is pretty cool. So I wanna roll up these ramps, roll up this ramp, roll up this ramp. Whoa, not roll off the board. Try that again. One more. So close. All right, let's do this one more time. Oh, wrong ramp. This one having that gap there is the challenge. There it is. I will right, we'll do one, maybe two more. So we're going to move. Whoa. We want to not roll over that. Uh, there we go. And then another not roll over just lightly in through there. Okay, this one's tricky. And I find playing this with the phone controller like this 
to be really cool because what I can do is kind of fine tune how I'm rolling. Now this is the level I got stuck on playing in VR. Let's see if I can do any better playing in AR and VR. Probably not. Let's try to be slightly more fine-tuned. And I'm not. I am not slightly more fine-tuned. But I had a ball with this. So that's a ton of fun just using my phone here to control things. You can play gamepad games as well. I'm going to leave a link to the GitLab in my description of this video. I also want to mention Unreal is having an AR jam. I'm going to put my referral code for that AR jam in the description of this video as well. Would love to see you make something cool. And if you use my referral code, we both get some cool swag as well. You do not need to have an Nreal Light or Nreal Air device to be able to participate. They give you the tools that you need with the NR SDK. And if you just load up Unity alongside that, you'll be able to build an application that should work with both the Nreal Light and Nreal Air. I'm hoping that this spurns some really cool AR design from developers around the world. And I hope you get to check these out sometime because they are kind of the beginning of the AR future. I love being able to now play Steam VR titles to an extent with these glasses. Mark's Magnificent Marble Maze works great using kind of just the gyroscope and accelerometers in my phone. I was thrilled to be able to pull it up and play it. I hope you enjoyed this video. I'll be back with more content soon. Until next time, get out there and enjoy some VR or AR for yourself. And thanks for watching. Bye-bye now.